My father says we need to just get on with our lives. Like it's that easy. Take home Windhelm's finest and freshest... I'd travel more, but who wants to deal with all the soldiers these days? It was difficult at first. The Nords of this city are at best suspicious of outsiders. But in time, I made the right friends and proved myself useful enough that they don't give me trouble anymore. The Dark Elves are too proud and naive to understand the way things truly are, and so they continue to dwell in that slum. Just got here from the Somerset Isles. Lots of opportunity in Skyrim. Fresh fruit and vegetables for sale. Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Thank you for your custom. If you're looking to get a drink, Candlehurst Hall's got warm fires and strong ale. Assorted fruits and vegetables. Fruits and vegetables are all ripe and ready for your table. Speak quickly. Need something? Make it quick. I yes. Everything for sale. Come see for yourself. Yes. Need something? I lost my twin sister a while back. The townsfolk Have call me captain because else? I used to be a sailor. Terrible shame, that. Seems we have a killer on the loose here in Wilhelm. He's claimed three victims that I know of. Though maybe there's more that haven't been found yet. All lovely ladies, too. Let's hope the guards find that demon soon and introduce him to the head of Vax. There's an author named Adonato staying at the inn. He's published a few works of historical fiction. The clans Shattershield and Kurusi see most of the gold that passes through the city. And obviously you have Ulfric, the Jarl and future High King. Oh, and that busybody Viola Giordano. She's got her nose in everyone's business, which I guess is one way of being prominent. Well, nothing. At least not anymore. Folk just call me that because of what I used to do. I was a sailor for many a year. I made my coin as a trader, and in time, I bought my own ship. When I retired here in Windhelm, most folk already knew me as Captain Lonely Gale, and the name just stuck. If you're looking to pass the time, you can give Kalix to a few septims and gawk at whatever oddity he's come across lately. If you're in need of goods, there's a market. If it's a soft bed and a hot meal you're after, there's Candlehearth Hall. Fair winds and calm seas. That's an old sailor's party. I have a little of everything. I lost my twin sister a while back. Need something? Have you ever lost anyone close? There's an old saying that only a Nord can work the soil in Skyrim. I don't think anyone else would have the patience for it. 
It takes half a day just to dig a planting row in the cold, stony earth here. But what else can we do? Eat rocks and ice? Everything you see is grown at my family's own Holly Frost farm. Fresh and filling. I also do a little herb growing. The court wizard, Woundfirth, pays us to plant a little nightshade. Who knows what he uses it for? Hey, could you deliver this bottle of nightshade extract to Woundfirth? Thanks. Good day to you. There's no glory in war. It's just something... You one of those Skyrim for the Nords types? Good. Too many Nords in this town have been listening There's to Ulfric's narrow-minded words. He's tough. Loyal to his men, and a good leader. But if you're not a Nord, Ulfric will never trust you. Whenever a group of marauders attack a Nord village, Ulfric is the first to sound the horn and send the men. But a group of dark elf refugees gets ambushed, a group of Argonians or a Khajiit caravan, no troops, no investigation, nothing. There's a group of cutthroats out there right now that Ulfric doesn't lift a finger to bring to justice, as long as they don't threaten Nord land. That's a brave offer. I'd be happy to throw in my coin behind that. You deal with them. I'll make sure you get paid. Maybe this old soldier will throw in some lessons as well. Show those marauders what Windhelm justice tastes like. Poor Nilsine has been wrecked since her sister was killed. It's all in the swing. Let me show you. Come and browse my fine selection. Everything's fresh and delicious. Please forgive my mood. I'm still coming to terms with my daughter's death. Working in Windhelm is great. I get to see Ulfric up close. I'll be fine. <laughs> Master, you're far too old for this sort of journey. We don't know what's inside. Uh, uh, I'll... Uh, I can... <laughs> Just... <clears throat> you see, you're not well. Have a seat, and I'll fetch you some tonic. Now, oh, if there was a tonic that could help me, I would have found it by now. My master can be a bit short-tempered, but I've learned so much from him. Are you kidding? I came all the way from Cyrodiil just to work with him. He's... he's not the best teacher, but just watching him, I've learned so much. I don't mm -hmm. appreciate loiterers, if that's what you're here to do. I'm so close to the answer. Just a man's life work is all. I finally derived the location of the White File, but this dirty busybody won't let me get it. You would do that? It's good to know there are some people out there who are willing to help an old man. It's buried with its maker, Kural Mill, in a long forsaken cave to the west of here. Kralmil was a crafty one, even in death. You would need the skills of a master alchemist to reach his resting place. Luckily for you, I've already made the mixture. Here, take it. Please, don't, don't dally. I've wasted enough time arguing with my useless assistant here.
I've spent my entire life searching for it. It brought me all the way to these frozen reaches from the warm embrace of Somerset Isle. Entire years spent in libraries, seeking out tiny villages with local legends that contain but a whisper of a hint of the file. I even named my shop after it, hoping that it might attract anyone who had heard of it. And now it's within my grasp. But the eight, it seems, <coughs> have chosen me for their amusement. <laughs> for in my current condition, I'll never be able to lay my hands on it. A legendary bottle, forged in the days when Skyrim was just starting its turn to ice. A small container made of the magically infused snow that first fell on the throat of the world. It is said that the file will replenish whatever fluid is placed inside of it. For an alchemist like myself, it is the most pure expression of my art. To create from nothingness is... poetry. Ah, so you're an alchemist then. My master can be a bit short-tempered, but I've learned so much from him. I hope you have coin to spend and you're not just here to gawk. Look at my goods. May the eight guide you to the... So, you're interested in my potions and ingredients. My job's simple enough. The dead don't really complain much.
Hear my prayer, son of Akatosh, and grant peace to these departed souls. You know about town? He founded the Empire. Aldrich won't give us a straight answer. He's a My heart goes out to Clan Shattershield. Kin murdered, Don't be family so warhammer stolen. We've There's intercepted no couriers from Solitude. The Empire's putting a great deal of pressure on White Run. And what would you have me do? If he's not with us, he's against us. He knows that. They all know that. How long are you going to wait? You think I need to send Bolgraf a stronger message? If by message you mean shoving a sword through his gullet, Taking his city and leaving him in disgrace would make a more powerful statement, don't you think? So we're ready to start this war in earnest, then? Soon. I still say you should take them all out like you did dead King Torig. Torig was merely a message to the other Yars. Whoever we replace them with will need the support of our armies. We're ready when you are. Things hinge on White Run. If we can take the city without bloodshed, all the better. But if not, the people are behind you. Many, I fear, still need convincing. Then let them die with their false kings. We've been soldiers a long time. We know the price of freedom. But people are still weighing things in their hearts. What's left of Skyrim to wager? They have families to think of. How many of their sons and daughters follow your banner? We are their families. Well put, friend. Tell me, Gotmar, why do you fight for me? I'd follow you into the depths of oblivion. You know that. Yes, but why do you fight? If not for me, what then? I'll die before elves dictate the fates of men. Are we not one in this? I fight for the men I've held in my arms, dying on foreign soil. I fight for their wives and children whose names I heard whispered in their last breath. I fight for we few who did come home, only to find our country full of strangers wearing familiar faces. I fight for my people, impoverished to pay the debts of an empire too weak to rule them yet brands them criminals for wanting to rule themselves! I fight so that all the fighting I've already done hasn't been for nothing. I fight because I must. Your words give voice to what we all feel, Ulfric. And that's why you will be High King. But the day words are enough will be the day when soldiers like us are no longer needed. I will gladly retire from the world, were such a day to dawn. Aye, but in the meantime, we have a war to plan. Only the foolish or the courageous approach a Jarl without summons. Do I know you? 
Is that so? Ah, uh, yes. You were with us at Helgen. Destined for the chopping block, if I'm not mistaken. Dunmere gets their drinks at the new Nissus Corner Club. Why they can't just call it a tavern is beyond me. Then it's true, what everyone is saying. That Aventus Artino is doing the Black Sacrament? Trying to summon the Dark Brotherhood? Oh, Grimbar, always with the nonsense. No, no, of course not. Those are just tales. Fine, then I'll invite him out to play. He lives right there. I'm going to knock on his door. No, child, wait! That boy, that house, they are cursed. Ha, huh, then I'm right, I knew it. He's trying to have somebody killed. All right, I won't deny it, child. What you heard is true, but Aventus Aretino walks a dark path. His actions can lead only to ruin. Now, enough. We will speak no more of this. I am the only friend you need. Mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. Please, how long must I do this? I keep praying, night mother, why won't you answer me? Finally, it worked! I knew you'd come! I just knew it! I did the Black Sacrament over and over with the body and the things. And then you came, an assassin from the Dark Brotherhood! Of course you are! I prayed, and you came, and now you'll accept my contract! My mother, she... She died. I... I'm all alone now. So they sent me to that terrible orphanage in Riften. Honor Hall! The headmistress is an evil, cruel woman. They call the Grella the kind. But she's not kind. She's terrible to all of us! So I ran away and came home and performed the Black Sacrament. Now you're here and you could kill Grella the kind! To be honest, I'm kind of lonely here. As much as I hated getting sent to Honor Hall, I really miss my friends there. Broad is the headmistress of Honor Hall Orphanage, but not for long. It's Honor Hall Orphanage in Riften? She got sick last winter when the snows came and she just, she never got better, not all year. One night she fell asleep and never woke up. 
So now I'm all alone. And the Jarl said I have to go into Honor Hall Orphanage. It's not fair! I've never been more sure about anything in my entire life. Someone like Broha doesn't deserve to live one more day. She's a monster! Please hurry. To be honest, I'm kind of lonely here. As much as I hated getting sent to Honor Hall, I really miss my friends there. This one's a favorite of mine. A legend we all know and love. This here's Candlehearth Hall. Great rooms upstairs, and there's a bed for rent on the ground floor. I tell you, I tell you, the Dragonborn comes. With a voice-wielding power of the ancient Nord art. Believe, believe, the Dragonborn comes. It's an end to the Poor Nilsine has been wrecked since her sister was killed. May the gods watch over your battles, friend. Every night, I walk around a great quarter and For let the them darkness grace this has passed, and the legend yet grows. You'll know, you'll know the dragonborns come. Seeing a good tavern brawl might be just the thing to lift my spirits. We ought to dig a big hole. Only thing I hate... Oh! Alleys, rundown buildings, few guard patrols. Even the name Grey Quarter is an insult. That's all I ask. With your help, we have a chance to make a better life for ourselves here. For that, I thank you. I thought the Grey Quarter would be a haven for my kind. Windhelm is divided into four quarters. The Grey Quarter is the one that's home to all the city's dark elves. If it looks to you like an impoverished slum, that's because it is. Ulfric prefers that we live in squalor. He has nothing but disdain for anyone who isn't a Nord. He tolerates us, but that's the extent of his hospitality. Not a day goes by that I don't think about returning to the ancestral home of my people. Still, even with the rough treatment we've had at the hands of Ulfric and his lot, I've got ties here. A 
It's probably more trouble to pack up and leave than it is to stay. Besides, Amberus can't run the corner club on his own. It was a pleasure. The Great Quarter is not much to look at now, but it wasn't always so bad. Farm work is hard work. It's good to relax when I can. I still have to listen to my brothers harping about the differences. The corner club's been filling up at night lately. I'll bet Elda up at Candlehearth is jealous. How splendid. Another Nord. Where else would we be? When the Red Mountain burned, you could scarcely breathe in Morrowind. So we came west. Windhelm was the first city on that road. And here we are. If we had known the Nords would be so unwelcoming, we may have kept walking. None of that matters to me. Until someone takes a Dunmer, I'll let Windhelm deal with its own problems. If you need another drink, I'll be right here. Farm work is hard work. It's good to relax when I can, but I still have to listen to my brothers harping about injustices. I'm a sailor on the North Wind. We're laying over in Windhelm. I was one of the best soldiers in the Stormcloak army, until I took a sword to the chest. Be on the lookout. The butcher could be around any corner. Got some fresh bait. Mind you don't get fresh. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. We'll drive out the empire from this land that we own. With our blood. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Let me know if there's anything else you need. Women, I'm worried about my own safety. All hail to Ulfric. You are the High King. In your great honor, we drink Every night, and we I sing. Around a great quarter, and that gray skins know what We're the children of, of Skyrim, and we fight all our lives. And when Southern Guard beckons, every one of us dies. But this land is ours, and we'll see it wiped clean. Of the scourge that has sullied our hopes and our we dreams. We don't want your kind here, Dark Elves. All hail to Ulfric, you are the High King. In your great honor we drink and we sing.